In a recent turn of events, PBA fans eagerly await the press conference scheduled for November 5th, where the fate of basketball superstar Justin Brownlee will be discussed. The seasoned import had previously made headlines during his impressive performance in the Asian Games, but recent developments have raised questions about his future in the league. PBA chairman Al Francis Shua has weighed in on the matter, addressing the uncertainty surrounding Brownlee's status. While there is no definitive decision at this point, Shua made it clear that the league has no plans to open Sample B, referring to the sample collected during Brownlee's time in China. The situation remains fluid and the league will await further developments. Shua expressed his disappointment at the abrupt turn of events, especially following the country's triumphant gold medal win in men's basketball. He also lamented the negative response from some quarters regarding the Asian Games incident. Shua suggested that the matter could be a Chinese error. Rather than prematurely speculating about potential consequences for Brownlee, Shua acknowledged that this is the first such incident involving Brownlee, particularly within the San Miguel Corporation camp. He emphasized that this does not involve performance-enhancing drugs, unlike other high-profile cases. While Brownlee's hotel remains unscathed, there is a chance he might still play in the upcoming PBA season, as long as the World Anti-Doping Agency WADA and the Court of Arbitration for Sports CAS. Investigations do not lead to suspension. However, in light of the uncertainty, Barangay Ginebra is exploring potential backup import options.